Let's now turn our attention to Adamawa State, where Chairman of Christian Association of Nigeria and Catholic Bishop of Yola Diocese, Dam Mamza, is calling on security agencies to arrest and prosecute controversial Islamic leader, Sheikh Ahmed Gumi, for inciting religion, religious crisis among Christians and Muslims. Speaking during a special service to mark the 15 years coronation anniversary of Igwe Omenaka is in Yola, the clergyman insisted that it will be unjust if Unam Dekanu would be arrested for felony and Ahmed Gumi will be allowed to walk as a free man after committing similar offence. TVC News Awola Biadenusi filed in this report. It all began with a Sunday congregation service to mark this year Igbo days in Adamawa State. The Christian leaders testified to the holistic move by Tinubu-led administration towards the development of the nation by assembling the best brain to hold various positions of authority, including the Minister of Federal Capital. Speaking at the Sunday Mass at St. Theresa Catholic Church, Yola, the Gant chairman called on Christians to show love to both Muslim and other Nigerians, irrespective of their tribes or belief. He frowned at the recent comment by the controversial Islamic leader Sheikh Ahmed Gumi demanding for the removal of the Minister of Federal Capital based on religion and tribal affiliation. And the position of minister should not be restricted to individuals from any specific religion or tribe. Any qualified and well-meaning Nigerian should have the opportunity to serve in that position. The Catholic bishop said that if Gumi should be allowed to move about as a free man, the IPOP leader, Namdi Kanu, should also be set free. Namdi Kanu, what has he done for God's sake? What has he, even if he has done something, he has never said anything that is worse than what Gumi has said. The Igbo community leaders moved from the church to the palace of their traditional leader before heading to the capital secondary school where the event took place. The leaders used the forum to urge the Igbo community to support Governor Amadou Fintri and President Bola Tinubu. Support the federal government, support our president uh, Tinubu. I have accepted to be, to be an Igbo man from today. What I mean is I will defend their interests, protect their interests in my capacity as Omiodu in the Igbo of Adamastu. The highlight of the occasion was the decoration of different title holders. Residents want relevant authority in the state to wade in and resolve the leadership tussle in the Igbo community that made them to have two separate kings.